Look at the high ground! Look at the high ground! What's going on guys, we're back with another video and today I'm going to go through the Creative Destruction update that came out today. Um, we've got some new gadgets coming, we've got obviously the PSG back which everyone's buzzed for. So without further ado, let's get into the video and check out what it's all about. Remember that subscribe button, thumbs up on the video, let's go. So what's going on guys, so today uh, I'm going to um, talk about the update on mobile, I usually do it on PC, um, it's just much more smoother and faster, but for you guys I'm going to do it on mobile today. So, we got the all new energy device, now this is basically like Thanos, I've seen a couple of clips of it already, and basically it's like freaking Thanos in the game. Um, but we are going to get into that, so, oh... Okay, not a bad skin. Uh, I guess we'll buy one just to see if we get it. Nope, let's buy 10 more. Nope, let's buy 10 more. Oh! Let's buy 10 more. And let's buy some more. Nope, nope. 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 Never buy packs. <laughs> right, okay. Uh, so, basically, um, yeah, there's a few new things that have been added, guys. We've got the new, obviously, the new, um, the new gadget, uh, the whatever device is called. We've got the new, as soon as I can get on the page, there we go. We've got the new energy device, which we're going to try out. We've got, obviously, the Cyber Raider skins. Um, we've got the new Cyber Raider. Now, I wanted to know if this was an actual gun or not. Ah, see, so it's a weapon skin. Right, so they kind of, uh, they kind of threw me off in the, um, what skin is it for? Is it, so what's it for? It's for, it looks like a scar. Or it looks like the uh, the farmers actually. Yeah, it looks like the farmers. So yeah, they kind of threw me off, guys, because that is actually a weapon skin. But they did mention in the patch notes um, that a new available weapon cyber raider will be on sale. So obviously they just missed out the skin bit. Um, so all it is is a skin, guys, um, and that's basically it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get into a game and I'm going to try this new uh, this new gadget out. Okay, so here we go, guys. Uh, we're going to check out the new gadget, the uh, energy device. So it only costs three materials, which is pretty cool. Um, so let's make a few of those. Let's see actually how long. Let's see if you can actually use it straight away. So if I pop that on there. Takes two seconds to use. Oh, my. Do you not take four? Da oh, my God. How long does it last for? Wow. So it lasts for about 10 seconds, 10 to 15 seconds. I think that was 15 seconds. And they only cost three to make. I mean, do you even need egg chairs anymore? Look how fast I was running. Let's just make a few of those. I mean, look at where the zone is. I mean, it's all the way over there. Here's someone behind now. Let's use this. Wow. Oh, my gosh. Oh my god, it's broken. It is actually broken. Wow, that is incredible. 
So you could quickly use it quick. So if you're like in a pinch and you want to get away from some enemies really quickly, you could just use it quickly. And look, look at the builds as well, guys. Look at the high ground. Look at the high ground. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's incredible. Wow, this this is this is I I can't see this being in the game for a long amount of time. That's all I'm saying. Oh, so you take full damage from it as well. Ah, so there's the catch. So there's no point in using that to go really high because you're still going to need a coke propeller to get off if you want to land safely. So they've made it so there's still full damage, but there's no. They, they've made it so when you jump from the ground, you jump up, and basically they've made it so the, the, the height you jump at cannot hurt you when you fall back down touch the ground so wow that's pretty insane i mean i can only see it being good in like situations where you need to run away from someone or you need to jump and get that high ground back but you still need to be careful because of the um fall damage so i would always have a coke propeller if you're using it but that is insane i love it and that's basically it. That's the uh, that's the other thing. We've got the new energy device, which I just showed you. Um, again, let me know what you think about that in the comments. Um, basically, the PSG. I've already I've already got gameplay out on the PSG. But if you want to watch gameplay of the PSG, you're gonna have to watch my streams and future videos. You already know what the PSG is like. It's a beautiful semi-auto sniper rifle that's just um, deadly and amazing. It's better than the VSS. I don't even know why the VSS is still in the game. One more thing to add as well, guys, is. There's a good new thing for PC users. They are getting rid and they are banning people who use macros. Because there's a lot of um, there's a lot of people that use macros in Creative Destruction. And macros are so... I personally think they, they obviously shouldn't be in the game. Because like I said before, say if, say if I'm on this side of the wall, there's an enemy on that side of the wall. He thinks if I don't have macros and I slowly build through, he's going to see that wall cracking and cracking and cracking. So he's going to know I'm coming through it. Now, with macros, guys, it means you can destruct of things literally in one second. So if I'm on this side of the wall, I can literally destruct the wall and go straight through and just kill him. And he won't have a clue because he'll, he'll be like, how did he get through the wall so quickly? So I think personally macros are broken. I'm glad they're banning it from the game. The developers are, are always doing good. They're bringing out new updates, um, updating the game for you guys all the time. So... Yeah, again, hit that subscribe button, whack a thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next one. Yeah, boy! Gila.